Okay, wrong chickens. It was the wrong Hold chickens. On, <laughs> oh, Lord, we almost bumped heads. Get him out, ladies, right there. All right, folks. Uh, hope you enjoyed the video. If so, make sure you leave a positive comment down below. And if you did not enjoy it, remember, I am Jason from Cog Hill Farm. I am Jason from Cog Hill Farm. And this here is Mary, this here is Mary Carl. This here is Mary Carl, the chair. <laughs>Hey folks, Lester here. Have you ever heard the expression, it's easier to beg forgiveness than to ask permission? You've heard that, right? And uh, those words have never been truer than what's gonna have to happen later this weekend. Jamie is out of town, and today I have made the executive decision. Yes, we are a partnership. We have discussed this many times, but we've never actually carried through with it because sometimes it's hard to actually carry through with things even though you know it's for the best interest of everyone involved. Let me give you the rundown of what's happening today and I'll explain and you'll soon find out why when Jamie comes home from her trip, I'll have to meet her <laughs> on my knees. I'll have to greet her while on my knees. All right, let me show you. Okay, there's a couple of things I wanna talk to you about. Let's start with number one, this guy right here. Now you probably have not met him yet, but you can look at this, uh, the cone on his head and see the dried blood. That would be dried blood. Ellie took a chance on rescuing this guy and it was it ended up almost costing us a rooster's life not his life but another rooster i will play that video snippet in a couple uh, to show you what i'm talking about so i'm waking up this morning and seeing this new rooster that ellie brought over here last night hi what's your name boy he's got his water dirty he uh Ellie come over and asked for some stuff, so I got him. I showed him where the chicken food was at. Told him what to use for a water container. Hello, what's your name? Wait a minute. Oh my gosh. Oh, what happened? Oh no, Maggie, no, move. Oh, sheesh. They've been fighting each other. Oh, Lord. Oh, buddy. That's our rooster. That's not Skippy, is it? Are you okay? Oh, no. He's mean. I thought I could see blood around his neck. There on his talons. And look at his little waddle. Look at his eyes. You look really mean. What's, what are you looking at me like that for? Oh boy. Well, all right, so as you can figure, he's not going to be able to stay here. But you really can't take a rooster and give him away without somebody taking that same rooster and making him to a soup, making him into fried chicken. So what we're gonna do, we found a guy that would be that would love to have some chickens and the rooster so that means i'm going to have to give away a couple of hens with him and so i could very easily just send off the rooster but i'm afraid pablo stop following me around you're not going anywhere pablo all right so we have these three ducks these are three female ducks that will not leave the barn now listen, y'all, they were born and raised here, and their only source of water, their only source of water, I'm going to show you, is that little water pool right there. For some reason, they will not leave the barn, and they have never left the barn. And so they sit here all day, 
they get into my feed room. They, <laughs> they won't leave. And then we have Tom. Not you, Pablo. You're staying here. You're not going anywhere. We have Tom, who is our male duck who's mean. You've all seen Tom. I don't see him right now. But he's the little male duck that hangs out with Adam or Steve. And he's mean to everybody. Guys, don't even act like you don't know who I'm talking about. Tom is white. He's the one that goes in there and picks on Petunia. He, well, he pecks at her and scares her. She doesn't know where he's at. And so my idea is to offer these guys a better home than what they have here. And in the process, kind of help our farm along a little bit. So I'm going to take these three along with a male. That's one set of animals that I'm going to rehome today. I have the perfect owner, a, the perfect owner who has his own little farm, and he's going to love them. Now, his pond is nothing like ours. It's nothing the size of ours. It's about half the size of Kim's, but it's cute, it's water, and it's better than a little pool. So that's what's going to happen with these four ducks. Now, secondly, we have this rooster that Ellie brought home. You guys know that he is a fighter. You remember that he is trouble. I don't know his history. We tried to save him, but he's just, he's trouble. We cannot keep him. We're going to take him with these three hens right here. You better stop before you go right along with them. Now I'm gonna keep you, you ain't going nowhere. All right, so what I'm gonna do is try to give this guy a little bit better home than what he would ever have being caged up over here with a couple of pretty females. And uh, he'll have his very own family at a really nice farm. All right, that right there is Tom. He is the white Muscovy duck that hangs around with Adam or Steve, and he is mean, okay? Now, when I say he hangs around with Adam or Steve, they're not friends. They're not friends at all. As a matter of fact, they're arch enemies. He is mean to every animal we have around here. He's mean to our kittens. He's mean to our dogs. He's mean to our pigs. He's especially mean to poor Petunia, who's blind and deaf, and so we're going to go ahead and keep Adam or Steve. He also has Pablo. And Tom is going to go have a forever home with three pretty little ladies where the ducks will no longer have to be fighting each other over the females. Uh, they'll have a small pond and they're going to be happy. If you're still watching, thank you. If you're just waiting to say something mean in the comments, I can't really imagine what the comments are going to say, but it's probably going to be some really mean things. But guys, I am trying to make a farm decision based on the betterment of the farm. So keeping these three little female ducks who live here. This is their home. Guys, they're going to get plenty of food. They're going to be fine. They're going to be... There has to be a reason why they don't go to that pond. There has to be a reason why they don't go to the pond. And then, uh... Sending off the three little female ducks without the little male would not be very fair. I'm looking for the net. All right, so a job like this is going to require a net. So we do have this net that I keep in my boat. This will be one net that we can use. So here's my help. All right, so I had the camera in y'all's face. Y'all pull up with the camera in your face. Number one, I have to ask you permission for something. Uh -oh. Have you already found a place for this mean rooster? Uh, I was going to ask Paw Paw. Good, okay, fine. Then that means no. All right, so I found him a great home. Did and you? Yes, and get this. We also have to give away two, if we can catch three hens with him, so he'll go to a farm with his very own family. Okay. 
Okay. So in that, in saying so, we have to use the casting net. That's where you come in. Okay. To cast and catch a couple of our hens. I'll tell you which ones that we will put into the kennel, the little carry case, and send him along with some ducks to a really nice guy who I know from the church. Not who? Pablo. No, no, Pablo's yeah, staying here. Okay. So, okay, so now I, as my witnesses, who is the meanest duck besides Pablo? Tom. Tom. Okay. <laughs> Tom is mean not only to us, but to all of our poor animals, especially Petunia. We're taking Tom and these three female ducks. They're hiding under Ellie's vehicle. We're going to put all of them and send us to the same guy. He already has a donkey. He has a couple of goats. Well, he does not have any chickens or ducks, and he would love to have them. So our job today is to get the casting net. I already have it pulled over here for you, okay. along with our minnow net. And we're going to capture and catch these babies. We good for that? Mm -hmm. All right, let's go. Was right here. There he is, Ellie. See him right there behind the... Oh, Tom. Oh, Tom. Okay. All right, try to be gentle, Ellie, because he can fly. All right. Ellie! 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 <laughs> Ellie, it's okay. I got him now. Ellie, all right. Ellie, huh. just pick him up with your hands, son. Right. Drop that. Pick him up. <laughs> oh! You go Ellie, I told you he's fast. No, you went fast. Like... Ellie, do you want me to let him fly away? Well, I can't catch him. Grab him, son. Do not let him go because he will fly. You got him? Nope, not yet. Squeeze him. Love him. All right, pet him a little bit. Over here. Now I got him. All right. Sheesh, Ellie. Don't you, do, don't you let him go. Put him right inside here. And then close, close the door. Hey. Let me see you scratch it, Ellie. Do we need band-aids? I think I'm okay. For... <laughs> so much for that net, Ellie. Sheesh, son. Okay. He's good. Jake does this kind of stuff, y'all. They might cr climb through. There's one. Grab it, Ellie. Grab the one. Maggie, no. Maggie. Oh, no. Well, that was real horrible. No, I'm going to get all three of them at one time. All right, here we go. We're going to try this again. They're under my truck over here. They're walking away from that truck, Jake. All right, L.A., see them this way, Jake. Oh, my goodness. You can't go this way, fellas. Use a casting net and try to cast them. Jacob, that was horrible. You're not going to chase them down, Jake. Told you. All right, we're still chasing ducks. All right, close them off in the barn. Y'all go to the other side. Go to the other side. Hurry, go to the other side. Ben, to the other side. Right here, Ben, Ben. Benjamin. Schumann, get into the barn. Into the barn. Bring the net, Ali. Bring the net. Bring the net, Ali. Bring the net. Grab him, Ben. Grab him, Ben. Oh, ben. Hey. You know, I'm realizing that I've never in my life had to chase ducks. No, never. In all of my years, I've never chased ducks. This is a first for me. It's not easy. All right, it may just take us dropping whatever we got and hand grab them. They're under the vehicle. So everyone go to, so, all right, here we go. Jake, here's one out in the open. Bring the net, Jake. Over here, Jake. You're taking it off. So where's it at? Duck Let's just get one at a time. <laughs> All right, Jake. We like walk and they kind of force them into the stall. So we, All right. So we need someone on like that side. Right, well, right through that stall. Go in that stall right there. Go, 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 go,
it wouldn't have been easy because we already tried that. All right, here comes L. Lee with another one. I wasn't watching. How did it happen? Uh, Jake, Jake, Jake Horsley here, and I caught him with the note. Oh, nice, Ellie. Yeah. We got one to go, Jake. One to go. And then we got to deal with chickens. Oh, sorry, Doug. Now, we could wait till nighttime. Oh, there it goes. We could wait. I'll close the gate. We could wait until nighttime for chickens, but the guy, I wanted to kind of take them all at the same time. All right, there he goes. He's about to crawl through, Jacob. And he's through. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. <laughs> Hold on, Ellie. We're going to put him in the big cage. In the big cage. In the big cage. We're going to transfer. Let's you and me transfer him all over to the big cage. Well, let me put this one in first. We are. There you go. Put him in there, and I'll hold the door while you get the other ones over here. Here, folks. I didn't capture it. Who is it? How was it? I ran. And you ran the, the duck down? Yeah, and then he was going under the fence. And you grabbed him at the right moment. And I, no, I don't. <laughs> Hold on, Ben, did you capture any of that? Yes. Yay! I look up, Ben standing like this, his eyes are huge. He's like, oh. Funny. All right, so that's good. So now the ducks are good. They're going to be a very happy family. So we have room, guys. So check it out. We have room for our chickens in here also. We're going to put the rooster in here by himself and the hens inside here. Oh, they're watching their video. I'm not helping in, unless something bad happens. Close it, Ben. Oh, if he goes in there that easily. <laughs> Don't let him jump out. Don't let him jump out, Ellie. He's not going to do it that way. You have to catch him with your hands. He, you're gonna, he's going to fly himself over if you're not careful. He's going to fly himself out of here. He's going to fly himself right out of here if y'all are not prepared for that. Oh, Lord, we almost bumped Ted. Get him, Ellie! He's right there! Get him, Jacob! Ellie, get that rooster! Get him! Get him on, Rocky! Come on, Rocky! <laughs> oh, my goodness! We're looking for some particular hens that are not very nice. I hate to think that we're getting rid of our troublemakers, but in a way, that's exactly what we're doing. Aha! All right. There they are! I found them! All right, what one? Just All right so those two, those two dark colored ones, not the little Goldie. Goldie's a really good one. So those okay. two dark, hold on, take this food. Like this one right here in this corner? And, and yes, you can take that one. Really? Those two dark hens jake these guys are horrible i know what you're uh, lola i hope you're enjoying that chicken food <laughs> oh gosh oh my gosh now she's in there with carl man there goes there, there's all three of them jake that's all three of them right there it does this well, I did it once. The duck got away. Oh, 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 yeah. Does that really count, though, Jake? If the duck got away, I had no backup. That's I was true. like a like what I like a videoing. roper. You cannot blame me. I was videoing. You know, like a roper has to rope the calf, wow. tackle the calf, tie up the calf. When the time comes, you what? I will need you ready to pounce when that time comes. Okay. All right, hold well, on. We gotta locate him first. Look at copper. Okay, look at copper. Oh my gosh. <laughs> copper, what are you doing? Jake? Yeah? Right. No, they're too walk close in that way, corner. Walk this way. Walk this way, LA. A little bit more. <laughs> oh, Liz, you got a double, but it was the wrong ones. Okay, wrong chickens. It was the wrong Hold chickens. On, <laughs> <laughs> wrong oh, chicken, my Ellie. gosh. Yeah. <laughs> Jacob. He caught the wrong one. He was like, let me show you how to do this. And he caught the wrong two. He was showing how to do it. 
Uh, no, yeah, whatever, <laughs> whatever. <laughs> oh, that's an easy one, Les. That's an easy one. That was an easy one. Oh, no. Here, I'm just grab him. Just run and grab him, Les. Les, they're in the corner. Just grab him. Oh, nice. All right. Oh, that went in with Carl. All right, Jake. All right, Jake. How many chickens have you caught so far? A lot. No, how many chickens have you caught? Be honest. Chickens? Uh-huh. I don't think any. None. I've caught one. Ellie's no, caught two ducks. One. I caught two Dang. ducks. All right, Jake. What do you think's harder, chickens or ducks? Ducks. Jake, the honest to God truth. No, ducks are easier to grab. I don't know if a chicken, don't they have something underneath their wings that they could get me with? We got one more chicken, Jake. <laughs> oh, no. Ellie, go around there. Oh, right here. I have no, I have no throw here. No, don't let it go under. Don't let it go under. I got scared. I'm not gonna lie. I got <laughs> terrified. Copper, help! <laughs> oh yeah. Yeah. I feel accomplished. I feel glad that it's, it's over. Good. Yeah, it's glad. All right. Don't let them go as we put them in the cage. Who wants to do the honors? Somebody Ellie? else. I don't want to go all the way. Right. honors. Okay. Ellie gets the honors. Jake, how'd you do it? Tell me how it happened because we didn't see it. Well. Were you able to video when you did it? Maybe. Maybe. Okay. Hold on, Ellie. Up here close to me. But what had happened was we ran around here and then. Newt oh, he got was, trapped and the, Newt, Newt was, was in here. Over here. He heard it in this way. Oh, oh all perfect. Up, yeah. Down. And I her. Oh, oh Lord. All right. So I hate to do this because these guys have been here for a long time since, since birth actually. And, uh, but we do got to weed them out a little bit. We're getting a few too many. We're not hatching any more eggs and, uh, it's going to be, a, they're going to have a really nice farm home life with somebody else. And so what do you want to say? All your final words, this Thanks. little girl, we love you. So how's Jamie going to feel about this? She's gonna, we're all gonna find them? new homes. No, I, I, I haven't all. I'm gonna, what do they call that? I'm going to Just beg forgiveness. For forgiveness. Beg forgiveness, then ask permission. All right, so there we go. So that guy will have him a nice little uh, farm with all of the same types of chickens and birds, fat ducks and chickens. And Megan finally shows up. Megan, if you knew what You're we just went through. What does that mean? She's a blister. She shows up oh, after the shows up after the work is done. All right, hold on, Jake. We'll need some of this. All right, take this here. Put it like under your hat. Put your hat off. Put that down. Put the hat back on. Yeah, that looks blonde hair. That looks kind of blonde. That'll work. That looks good. Mary's Carl hair is kind of short. Okay, that's good. That's good enough. Come on, Jake. All right, folks. Uh, hope you enjoyed the video. If so, make sure you leave a positive comment down below. And if you did not enjoy it, Remember, I am Jason from Cog Hill Farm. I am Jason from Cog Hill Farm. And this here is Mary, this here is Mary Carl. This here is Mary Carl. And this here is Mary Carl, the chicken expert. And it was her idea. The, ch <laughs> the chicken lady, the chicken expert. Yes, for all the negative comments. <laughs>